I want to introduce you to a brand new collection from Hot Off the Press called Secret Garden. And this, we're going to start with our 12 by 12. Now, as always, you can see all of the papers on the front. There are 12 of them. And on the back, there is a project. That's gonna be true of everything I'm gonna show you. But I'm not gonna bother showing you the back of the insert. I'm gonna show you what those projects look like. But first, let me show you Secret Garden. Now, what's different is that this is printed on cardstock. So we are doing that with all of our papers now. It is 80 pound, 85 pound cover weight, and it's 176 GSM, if that is something that you are watching for. <clears throat> of course, they're acid-free and lignin-free, as always. And on the back side, you're going to see another sheet. Now, here's another one. And you've got these flowers. Now, these flowers are called cone flowers. They're also echinacea. Now, I take echinacea tea when I get a cold, so it's nice to know that they're right here. There's the back of that one. You can see there's butterflies. In fact, the flowers are known to attract fly, butterflies, bees, songbirds, and dragonflies. So you're going to see some others. This has that lovely blue background. Now we have added some lavender into this. So very pretty. In fact, you're going to see lavender and lily of the valley right into the artwork. Oh, so pretty. There's some more of the lavender. And as you can see, there's a lot more of the Lily of the Valley right there. And on the back side, you've got this. And then we have cutouts. Now, in this case, we have a total of uh, 36 cutouts. You're going to get two sheets of everything I've shown you. And then on the back side of this, you can also see another all over pattern. So just really gorgeous. And again, it's all in cardstock weight. Here is a scrapbook page made using the Secret Garden. And this is one of the cutouts. And you can see it just all works so nicely. I want to tell you, if you are a card maker, we designed these. In fact, I take a template and make sure that every quadrant, every fourth of it, will make a beautiful card. So we do that just thinking of you. This is also the, a card that's on the back of the insert, and you can see how beautifully that lilac goes with, again, one of the cutouts. Just really nice, a little bit of jute along the fold, and you've got a lovely card. Now, we're also continuing to have our uh, regular cardstock. Now, this cardstock is 12 by 12, but we've made a change to it also. It is now double-sided. So you're going to get the same color on both sides, and you're going to get six colors. You're going to get two of each, just like the um, printed uh, or the patterned paper. It's all printed. <laughs> so you're going to get this a medium green. You're going to get a deeper green. You're going to get a purple, of course, to go with the lavender. You're going to get a pink because we've got pink uh, echinacea and coneflowers all over. You're going to get blue to go with the others, and you're also going to get a beautiful gold. Now, all of these just come in the package. They're all cardstock, and it's going to look like that. But there's more. We've also taken this into a six by six size. Now, the six by six size has 24 sheets. They are exactly like the 12 by 12, except they're scaled down. There are 24 sheets, as I said, double-sided, but you end up with 72 cutouts, really nice. And here's a way that you could perhaps use this. This is the card that's on the insert. You can see that the cutouts are scaled down to go with the papers. It works beautifully. And of course, it works beautifully with the cardstock, as you would expect. Now, we also have die cuts. And the die cuts number 31. There are 31 in the package. There are two different sheets. Let me just show you. You can kind of see them on the cover. But there they are. They're all die cut for you. And in fact, you can see that they're just going to pop out quite easily. And it does use the artwork, of course, from the paper pack. And here's a way that you could use them. So this has got one, two, three of the die cuts onto the papers and just works beautifully. Here's another card, again, using the solid card stock as well as the die cuts and the papers to coordinate. 
and yet there's more. In fact, I'm going to keep saying, yet there's more all through this. We have done a chipboard because we just love the chipboard and the price is so affordable and there are so many things that you can do with them. In fact, here is the insert. Here's the card that's on the insert. There are 20 pieces on this uh, six by six piece and you just pop them out and you can color them with markers. You can use embossing powder. There's just so many things that you can do because they're very thin and they're very lightweight. They're perfect for cards, pages, planners, whatever you like. And they just add a very nice depth to your projects. Now, I talked about Secret Garden and we've done some other things with Secret Garden. In fact, we work with Deanna Pinnell and she designed some cutting dies. In fact, there are three of them, Secret Garden 1, 2, and 3. Now, these will enable you to take the, the dies. You can use them separately. This has been using uh, number 1 and number 2 and shape them. In fact, Debbie just shaped them right over the papers, and that just gives really a nice depth. Oh, and she added some sparkle, too or you can layer the three of them together as was done right here. And doesn't that look great? Yes, and that's also using the papers, of course, from the Secret Garden. Now, as I said, the cone flowers, the echinacea flowers, it's also called kind of a shuttlecock flower. I think you can see why. Um, they do draw um, all the winged things that we love so, Deanna also did a butterfly cutting die. There's two of them. And she pointed out that, you know, you can really, because she separated the wings and gave us two bodies, you can use a silhouette of a butterfly. And that's what has been done on this project. In fact, those butterflies are fluttering on over some acetate with some of the cutouts behind them. Just really pretty. There's also, in our garden, hummingbirds. In fact, the hummingbird that Debbie did on the six by six papers is just beautiful. And it is using the um, glitter uh, acetate that has glitter embedded in it. Oh, so pretty. I love hummingbirds, just really nice. We also have dragonflies. And I'm gonna wait just a moment before I show you a project using that. So you can see how this secret garden goes with that secret garden but there's more. Remember I said that we have um, the uh, lavender and the lily of the valley in it? Well, that's because Dominica did some cutting dies with lavender. And here is a lavender mist oval. And here's a lavender mist bouquets, two of them. And here they are together. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Here is this piece that has the um, pot as well as the lavender. And then this one has been placed on top of it. Oh, so pretty. And here is our oval, just lovely. But that's not all, there's more. Here is the lavender mist circle. And remember I told you about our missing dragonfly? Well, look at this. Isn't that pretty? And it's been double layered with two different colors of the cardstock. And here is our lavender mist circle. And you even get a couple of extra lavender mist, lavender mist sprays that you can add if you'd like to do that. I'm not quite done. We did lavender, but we also added lily of the valley. And here is the lily of the valley circle. And here is a project using that on our slimline cards. How pretty. And there's also one last one, a lily of the valley rectangle. And here it is on this easel card. Just letting that stand up and say hello. Just absolutely beautiful. So you can see there are many parts to our secret garden. We've got lily of the valley, we've got lavender, we have the secret garden and all of the fluttering creatures to um, support them. And then, as you can tell, the 12 by 12 cardstock, the 6 by 6 cardstock, the double sided cardstock, as well as our chipboard, 
and our die cuts. Everything coordinated and everything is available now. And I forgot to mention, it's exclusive here at paperwishes.com.